Good morning, guys. It is 6.25 a.m. I know, yeah, I think you should subscribe as well. <laughs> Just on my way to meet Dan. Go down for a early morning cut hours. It's fresh this morning. That was pretty fresh as the other day, though. Not too bad, it's good some early weak miles in, <laughs> not good. So today we're giving ourselves a bit of a challenge. We're going round the Sandringham Estate, a really nice loop. We're gonna see how quickly we can do it, and then test again in another month. How are you feeling about that, Dan? Really looking forward to it on first thing on a Tuesday morning, but yeah, you know, whatever, we'll get at it. <laughs> Go, 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 <laughs> <Allez, allez. laughs> I can't catch him on this bike. He's killing it. I was just able to pass him on a hill to get converted. He's killing it. He's killing it. Done. How's it feel, mate? It's hard. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> god. If he asks you to train with him, just say no. <laughs> just don't. <laughs> so now up home, seeing Dan off, did really well today. I'm really proud of him. I feel there's a cyclist chasing me behind. He's been speeding up a lot recently. So I'm going to put this down and put the hammer down. <laughs> hey guys, how you doing? So tonight I want to talk about a little bit of a challenge, what I've got coming up, and I'm actually really, really excited about it. So I spoke a little bit about it on my Instagram last night. Basically, I'll tell you the story. A friend of mine came to me and said, Rob, how do you fancy doing some cycling? And that's a pretty easy guess to know what Antra was gonna to say to that. So I was like, yeah, yeah, what's up? And he said, so a company called Pure Sport CBD have a, a slot for a cyclist to be involved in a 12 hour bike ride. And I was like, okay, tell me a little bit more. And uh, the event is called Ultra X. And what they do is it's a challenge where you get in teams of three. So three cyclists, three runners and then there's going to be loads of other teams of cyclists, loads of other teams of runners and uh, you basically get the most mileage you can. So they said, Robbie, do you want to be involved? And I said, go 100%, absolutely 100%. Like a 12 hour ride just would tick a lot of boxes for me right now. <laughs> it really, really would. So I was lucky enough to be part of Pure Sport CBD team and it's really cool. I got to meet everyone. They're all awesome and I've got two teammates, a girl called Sophie and a guy called Ben. Ben is like a running coach and he's just a bit of a legend. His running times are silly. They're like, like minus 16 minute 5K. It's just it's crazy, it's crazy. And uh, Sophie is just like an absolutely awesome cyclist. So I'm in really good company with this challenge. And me, obviously I'm, normally racing a little bit distance, a bit longer than this, but it's gonna be exciting to try and do it. So I actually found out about two weeks ago, it actually happens in probably about 11 days now, so I'm not gonna lie, I have actually spent the last couple of weeks slowly building up to it, and now it's all kind of being confirmed, I'm like, yeah, let's go for it. So as you can see, my mileage has been getting a lot higher on my Strava, the rides I do put up, I'm not gonna lie, I don't share very many rides now. So yeah, it's gonna be exciting. Um, my kind of goals for it. So there's two kind of, you can do it indoor or outdoor. I want to do it outdoor because that's where I'm more suited to. If I do it outdoor, then I would like 
to be 330k, 200 miles. That's a big push though, that's a lot of power to hold for a very, very long time. And uh, if I was to do indoor, I'd expect maybe another 20, 30 miles on that. So yeah, so I'm, I'm excited to do it. I think it's a really welcome challenge. I've been feeling a little bit like since kind of the last couple of months, I haven't really been up to much and haven't really been able to work. So obviously I'm gonna be doing it on my, uh, my Richie, which is over there, but you guys, if you know me, you know exactly what that looks like. And yeah, I'm, I'm gonna smash it, it's in a couple of weeks, so I'll keep you guys updated on how it's going. And uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe and we'll catch up soon.